Uh, hello, I'm Oliver from Token Hobby. Here we got this uh, uh, forklift from Leisho. So this one, we will see how to operate with this ST8 uh, Fly Sky radio. So the radio settings, let's see it. So first, uh, go to the menu and uh, click on general menu. So we first go to the auxiliary channel to see the functions. So one to four, it is fixed with these two sticks. So channel one, steering, channel two, lifting, and drop, miss control with pump, channel three, that's for driving, forward and backward, channel four, tilting, Channel 5, VRC from here, VRC this one, that's for left fork. Channel 6, VRD, that's the right fork. So can move in together. So to control by two switch separately, can move the accurately the position you would like. Yeah, if you control by one switch, because the resistance is not the same, so they cannot move in all the same time, so very hard to move the, the position you like. Better to control separately. 5 VRC, 6 VRD, left and right fork. Channel 7, uh, VRA, that's the pump. Channel 8, SWB, that's the light. Okay, all on, also here light. Rear side also light, and also here have light. Let's check it. So turning left, turning right, forward, brake, braking red light, and the reverse. That's a reverse white light, and uh, channel nine SWC. That's the sound system. Horn, engine start and put to the middle again. So drive. The engine sound will increase with the throttle. And channel turn, key one. Channel turn, key one. That's the warning light. Changing different mode. Okay. Channel 11 and 12, actually now it's not connected. We have two more spare channel for the oil channel. So now it's because no have upgrade part, it's not connected. One here, that's the oil connection to one spare channel. Other side, one spare channel. Ah, sorry, not this one. This one is for the fork. Or at this side, two spare channel. It's here. So channel 11 and 12, we, I just leave the plug here, it's inside. Channel 1 to channel 10, all plug it in. Because if you plug in channel 11, 12, if you accidentally switch it on, it's for no using, yeah. Go back, let's see. From the monitor, here you will see which channel it is moving. So you can be sure which switch control which channel, corresponding to which function. Okay, so go back, reverse here. So let's say for the up and down, so it is channel two. Now it's rising. So channel two, if you want a different control direction, click it. It has changed the direction, reverse it. Now it's going up, now it's going down. Yeah, maybe most people like this, go up, good, go up. Others, if you like a different direction, you also can reverse it. For end point, let's see. So channel one for steering, not too much turning angle, yeah? So 80% left and right side. Going down. So for the channel seven, it is showing 20% for the left side, but the pump starts from negative 100% to negative 20%. 
So now it is almost running uh, around 40%. 50, 40, yeah, 40% of the pump. If you start all the way, that's 40%. Uh, we can go to later monitor to see again. So others, it's all 100%. And be careful, subtrim always, mostly it is 0%. But for this one, channel 3, that's for drive. Not to have the reverse signal, that's turn positive. Well, each machine will have a little difference, yeah? Need to adjust a little bit. And go back to see others for the mix. We have four mix for starting the pump. Let's see, mix one, click. So that's channel two and channel seven. That's the rise and the lower the, and with the, Channel 7 the pump. 100%, negative 100%, master channel 2 the arm. Uh, channel 7 that's the slave pump, go out. Mix number 2. So that's channel 4 and uh, with channel 7 also same, 100, negative 100. That's tilting with pump. Next one. Mix number three, that's channel five and uh, CH7 pump, that's left fork. Mix control start pump. Number four mix, that would be right side fork. So channel six and channel seven. Mix start the pump. So that's all four mix control to start the pump. So that's all. Here, monitor, click inside again, you can see the pump, how much moving for the progressing bar. Uh -huh, not 40%, it is around 60%. So, also 60% for the pump running, it's around almost 3 MPa for the pressure. So, if the pressure it is adjusted by the pressure valve inside, so for this one, the pressure it is enough. So there is another setting, uh, some people mistake, change it, we are lost to control. Go to the text set and uh, sliding down to switch settings. So here, two, two, three, two, or on. And the last one, CH number, channel number 12 for this one. So you are, we are using the receiver 12 channel all use. If you change it to 10, you will lose two channel. So 12, that's it. Thank you, that's all the radio settings for this forklift, forklift from Lesu. And this one, we get it a kit version and assembled, painted specially for our customer because he likes this painting. So what color you like, let me know. You can get it done as you prefer. Running a little bit to see. Check out the rear side turning signal light. On the top, slow down, put it down, which is in the end, slow down. Stop, rising up, tilting, move the fork, different size, thank you, I will bring you more models, anything you like, what you like to see, let me know, bye.